Finally, we are here at the airport, trying to catch the flight to Vienna, which will most likely be delayed because we are flying with Vueling. So they always tell yeah. you everything. It's yeah. Funny. But anyway, now it's a time to spin back to Catalonia. Guys, this is unbelievable. We traveled from Le Mans again. Our flight was cancelled. It took us 18 hours to get here to Barcelona from Le Mans, traveling through the whole France to catch different flights. It was just such a mess. We got here, morning we saw, saw some rain and then some process mistakes made us not ride today and we are not able to ride tomorrow. So it's such a mess, but unfortunately we prepared the whole box. We had a big plans because during the GP, as you know, we cannot film here. So we wanted to show you so much on board laps from the track, from the box, how it works, mechanics working. This was all in the plan during, during this pre-test. We are packing up now and we are going back home without making a single lap around the circuit. Not everyone actually had to cancel as you can as you can hear, but unfortunately we are the ones that yeah as I said we are packing up. You can see guys over there are just uh, putting the whole thing apart and uh, and yeah we are going back home. So the least thing I can do is to show you a little bit around my bike and we should definitely start with my dashboard and with all the buttons and all the things that are happening on the front. You've got here. The gear that is that is in, this is the traction control, fuel map, engine brake, number of laps that I completed, and here appears a lap time, and here appears a flex. It's new, basically this year, so after the check it flag, it just pops out a black signal with check it flag, or a blue flag, or a yellow flag, or a red flag, or whatever uh, message we need to get. There also appears the messages that I received from the from the guys from the box. So basically, uh, tire change, uh, bike swap, and stuff like that. And now let's go to the buttons. So we'll start on our right hand side. Well, of course we've got a throttle here. We've got a front brake here. Then we got a kill switch, and we've got. It's like if you want to engage neutral, you have to you have to oh, it's press like it. A switch then you to, to okay. enable. Yeah. Yes. Anyway. So you gotta you gotta push it in, in order to be uh, able to put neutral in. You know this bike. There is something a little bit special about it, and that is that when you are getting out of the box, the first gear is down, and the rest of them is down as well. When you are downshifting, you are actually pushing it up. When you get to the first gear. You'll press that button and then neutral comes in. We've got a clutch, we've got a brake adjustment. So if you are riding around, you know, during the race, uh, the brake can, can fade a little bit, so you just make it stiffer. Then you've got launch control, fuel mapping, pit limiter, engine brake, and traction control. So if I press that button, you can see here on the dashboard, that is going to a different maps. At the moment we are using three maps, maps for uh, each button basically, A, B, C, and that's just three strategies for each of those things that we can use uh, during the race. There is a couple more buttons. There is one hidden right behind there, you can't see it. And this is a kill switch, so it really switches off the whole bike. And also if you crash, you gotta restart the bike by switching it off and on again, like your computer. So this was something about my dashboard and the buttons that I'm using on a bike during the race. And now I'll just let you enjoy a little bit more of a B-roll of my beautiful bike over here. Oh, why hello there. We are, we are back, finally we are back to Vienna from uh, more or less from French GP. Well, yeah. So, uh, yeah, it was really bad. I'm, I'm really not happy, you know. We've got a, I got a great team. I got a very good bike. It's a GP16. But unfortunately, I'm really feeling like we are, if not on the limit, that very close to the limit. And it's so difficult. We are fighting real hard, as hard as we can, but 
we finish 17th and to get points it, it seems it seems just simply so much more difficult than it I was see. last year so yeah but we'll fight we'll keep fighting and next week there is a Mugello race I like that track so I'll do my I'll do my best to uh, to get some points over there yeah fingers crossed and uh, let's go to Brno now right spin to Brno that was a short visit to Brno because I've only spent one night here but meanwhile I uh, trimmed my grass on the garden I was doing a lot of stuff in the town I had a motorcycle school and photo shooting which you will see just in a second but right now you know what it's nine almost nine o'clock in the evening I got another even in our hotel in a great hotel and then we hit the road and go to well wait for it let's yeah, see yeah we'll show them hey.